Windows NT4 was the third release of Windows NT, a new, purely 32-bit and MS-DOS independent version of the Windows operating system that Microsoft maintained alongside traditional versions of Windows during the 1990s. Windows NT4 was released on the 24th of August 1996, exactly one year after the release of its MS-DOS based counterpart, Windows 95. Windows NT4 was the first version of Windows NT to include the now familiar desktop, start menu and taskbar user interface as standard, something which has remained fundamentally unchanged in almost all versions of Windows NT ever since, looking at you Windows 8. The main aim of Windows NT4 was to bring over the new user interface and features first introduced in Windows 95 a year earlier into the Windows NT line of operating systems. Windows NT4 did however also ship with other improvements, such as the introduction of a new Windows Task Manager utility. This combined the functionality of the Task List and Performance Monitor utilities found in previous versions of Windows NT, giving users a more convenient way of monitoring running processes on the system and which still exists in Windows today. With six service packs to its name, or seven depending on how you count, Windows NT4 officially received the most service packs out of any version of Windows NT. Microsoft even initially intended to release yet another service pack for the operating system, but this final patch was eventually rebranded as a post-service pack security rollup instead. Support for Windows NT4 ended on different dates depending on the exact edition used. The Workstation variant was the first to lose support, ending on the 30th of June 2004. Next was the Server Edition, for which support ended on the 31st of December 2004. Support for the Embedded Edition ended last, on the 11th of July 2006. Microsoft did, however, offer businesses the option of paid, extended support until the 31st of December 2006.